Round two highlights from the Web.com Tours Utah Championship held in beautiful Sandy, Utah. The views are stunning all week long. And guys are going low, even with the higher elevation. Starting off on the 18th, it's Darren Stiles. A very dramatic finishing hole here. A par 3 18th, and it was almost as dramatic as he gets with a near ace for Styles. He would tap that one in for birdie. Cannot believe it didn't go in. He would miss the cut though by one. Scott Wybring on the 17th. This is his third shot, sitting at three under. He had to finish strong to make the cut, which settled at five under par. He nearly holds out for eagle. He would go on to birdie the 17th though and the 18th to finish at five under and he is seeing the weekend. Blaine Barber on the ninth. You'll be seeing him on the PGA Tour next year. A very strong player out of Auburn. He would finish off with a 65, nine under overall. That was his last birdie of the day. And then over to Byron Smith on the 14th, sitting at nine under this to get to double digits. He had a tremendous front nine, going six under on holes three through seven, included an eagle. Slow down on the back, but the finish off at nine under overall, five under on the day. Adam Crawford now, the Aussie. He improved by a full 10 strokes from Thursday to Friday. I think we can call that finding something as he found the green in two here on the par five as he bounces it up there, giving himself a great eagle look, but would settle for birdie. Crawford with a second round 61 to go in at 10 under after 36 holes. Along with this guy, Soon Kang on the eighth. That was his long birdie. He's also heading into the weekend at 10 under par. But our story is still Andres Gonzalez had that round one 62, backed it up with a round two 67. He leads by two heading into the weekend at 13 under par.